Hello, today I'm going to show you how to upgrade from Ubuntu 17.4 to Ubuntu 17.10. This method should also work on Ubuntu 16.4. Now, today is only the 18th of September, so this is the pre-release version of Ubuntu 17.10. So the method is slightly different, but it's very stable and there's so much hype going around Ubuntu 17.10 so it's already worth upgrading I think. I've already upgraded on my main system so that's good. Already it's one of my main systems. <laughs> so first of all we have to go to our software and updates. This app here. You can just start to type in software and go to updates and make sure this is on for any new version. If it's on one of these options, move it to for any new version. And then you close this again. And now I'm going to open up a terminal and we're going to run these three commands. So I'm opening up a terminal now. Terminal now. And I'm going to move terminal to the left hand side. First of all, we're going to update our computer. This command will update our repos. So all the way up. <laughs> so let's quickly write in this upgrade. I'm sorry for that. I'll just see that. There we go. So it will basically run three commands in a row to update your computer, the repos, to install them if there's any available updates, and then to remove the um, clean the, the cache of your computer. So we're just going to copy this command and press enter, type a password, press enter, wait for the commands to run. As you can see, I'm fully up to date and there's nothing to clean. But if you got stuff, do it first. If you got some updates to run. And now we're gonna just check if this package is installed on your computer. It should be on your system, but if not, it's good to install it. It's needed to install. As you can see, it's up to date and already the newest version. Fantastic. And now we're just gonna run the upgrade app command. This is gonna take some time. So we're gonna press enter now because we're first gonna add new repos and remove the other ones and then it's gonna download about a gigabyte of data of the internet and then it's gonna install all the data and then it's gonna remove the packages which is no longer needed. And then we have to re reboot our computer. That's a quick summary of what's gonna happen. <laughs> so, that, so depending on your internet speed and the speed of your computer, this can take longer or shorter. And take a month, it will take about a gigabyte of data is going to download from the internet. But we will see exactly how much now. As you can see it's updating the repos now. As you can see it's already artful. It's the 17 code name. And As we were resisting as it artful. As you can see it's, it's this happened so much since seventeen but four the move to GNOME, all the extensions and the Ubuntu new theme and all those things, it's a lot. So basically it has to download seven hundred eighty five megabytes and so many packages are going to be removed, so many is going to be installed, and so many is going to be upgraded. So now we're going to press Y for yes, and enter to confirm. 
and this is gonna run now simultaneously to download all the packages and to install them so I'm gonna fast over this part and I'm gonna see you in a short while see you later Wonderful, as you can see the installation and the download process is finally finished, it took a while. Now it's setting for all the packages it needs to remove. And then we will have to press yes to confirm removing them all. And then it doesn't take too long and then another yes to reboot the computer. So we nearly finished. So. I didn't realize it will take so long, but yes, I think it's worth it. I really, I really think the Ubuntu team have done a great job with the new release. Much better than what I thought. <laughs> so, yeah. So as you can see, it's slowly moving up to 100%. And now we can press yes to confirm to remove 239 packages and I'm gonna fast over this part again, see you soon. Wonderful, and as you can see, wonderful, and as you can see the process is finished now. Now we can just press Y to reboot our system. And there we go. As you can see, we got a new wallpaper quickly there, and I'm gonna see you soon. Fantastic! As you can see, we just put it up, and we are in the new locking screen, and we can type in a password. Nothing changed in that sense. And here we go. The computer is booting up, and we were successful. As you can see we got a new wallpaper, if we go to system settings, like all my apps is still the same. In the dock, which is quite cool. We go to details, it's Ubuntu 17.10 and you are running. No, 3.26 already from the 18th of September, which is amazing. And 
as you can see the folder with my instructions was also copied correctly over. So yeah, it works fantastic and I really enjoy it. Thank you for watching, see you later, goodbye.